we found a Rogers wholesale discount store. Are you absolutely kidding me? Up to 90% off. Calm yourself down. This is where things go terribly, terribly wrong. What's happening, free game? We are coming to you live. But not live. From inside a hire car in Birmingham. <laughs> it's always different, isn't it? Yes, let us know, guys, where you are coming live but not live from. Any Birmingham free gang there? Let us know in the comments below, wherever you are, let us know. So, yes, we are in a hire car. And so those of you who saw our last few videos will be able to figure out that our van, our beloved van dream, is still in the workshop. So we've been stranded at Alton Towers for quite a few days now. Yeah, it's been quite the emotional roller coaster. I see what you did there. Thank you. Yeah, they told us at the garage it might be a while until it gets fixed as it's quite complicated. And so we had to make the tough decision to leave Dream up there at the garage and start making our way home. We couldn't get a train or a coach or anything like that home because we had so much stuff out of our van that we had to bring with us home. So that's why we had to get a hire car. And so here we are. And so while we were on our way home, Home, we thought could we take an opportunity and see if there's anywhere that we could do a fun shopping challenge because shopping challenges always make us happy and we know you guys love them too and we're in luck as we found a Rogers wholesale discount store on the way home in Birmingham as some of you may know we love Rogers we've been to Rogers before but we've only been to the one in Southampton so Rogers actually sells the stuff that other stores can no longer sell. Usually it's because the products are being discontinued or they're changing the packaging on them or they're doing rebranding. Sometimes it might be their seasonal products, like they might be Christmas products, they're still in date but no one's going to buy them because it's not Christmas. Or because they are past the sell by date, not the use by date. Yeah and sometimes with these products they can be up to 90% off. So of course we wanted to take the opportunity to go there. And sometimes you get free things. We've had so much here for free before. We like a bit of free stuff, don't we, Jodie? We like a bit of free stuff. But everything we've ever bought from a Rogers has been good quality. We've never bought anything that was didn't taste good or was off or mouldy or anything like that. It's all been really good. And a lot of the stuff has been in date as well. Mm. And apparently this one in Birmingham is a lot bigger than what we used at Southampton. So we can't wait to go and check it out. I spoke to Jamie this morning. I told her we might come here and she was so jealous and she said, Said this place is massive so we're really excited come on then so as you can see from their sign here this one's actually open to the public whereas a lot of wholesalers might be businesses only so anyone can come in here and just get some stuff because yeah. they're all about saving food waste so we like them too let's go in oh decent trolleys jojo calm yourself down we're filling this up okay This is huge, guys. This is massive. Yeah, definitely way bigger than the one in Southampton. <laughs> we might need two trolleys at this rate. Yes, what have you six, found? Six of these bottles of juice. They're like, no, I think they're a bit like, like apple and watermelon. Look, only five pounds for a case. So much bottled water. I know. It's just like, as soon as you walk in there, focus in on hydration. Yeah. <laughs> what have you found? 24 cans of Coke for four pounds. 16 is that? No, no, 24. 24. 24 cans of these Coke for four pounds. Wow, that's pretty good, right? Yeah. You'd pay about a pound for one of these. If On you its were, own, yeah. <laughs> at least. Basically, you're getting 20 cans of Coke for free, basically. You know what, Katie? I do like a drink when I'm driving in the van for you long do. times. Four pounds. Or a higher car in this case. Four pounds for all of these. Sunny D. Yeah, we don't tend to buy a lot of these uh, fizzy drinks, but you do like them in the van when you're driving. Well, we haven't got the van right now. But no. <laughs> when you're driving. Okay, we're gonna go for this one. It says tropical vibes. It, it looks pretty healthy, this one. Look at this, it says, it says, keep the vibe alive. I like that. I like that. What's the price saying? It's five pound for a case. They, they work at 34p each. I like that they've done the maths for us. I know. We struggle with a calculator, so <laughs> yeah. we need it. Just one case, we're saying? Yeah, we'll just yeah. get one, yeah? Okay. 
I bet we'll end up having to put it on the bottom at some point. Oh no. This is where things go terribly, terribly wrong. Three pounds for ten of these. Wait a minute, this is sweet chili popcorn. It's sweet chili popcorn crisps. Right, this is where the products end up in places like this where maybe something where they've tried a yeah. different kind of product and it's just not sold as much as they'd yeah. hope. Or they might just be changing the packaging or something. Yeah, well, it's going to be a winner with us though, maybe. Yeah. TT, we need to address though, you did a kind of dance thing when you saw that. Why yeah. was that? I did, something happened. Was it excitement at seeing this? Yeah, something happened. Just going to buy a whole box. Oh, because what? because the deal is by the case, isn't it? Yeah, it um, works out at just 30p each. But you've only got nine. All right, oh, here we go. It's found the tent. I knew we brought you along for something, Jojo. Right, yeah, I it's going underneath. I mean, we're actually on. We can make room. We can turn no. this this way and then we can put this in. Yeah. Oh, well done, Jojo. Hey. That's the reason why we brought you. Uh oh. Chocolate. Exactly. Caramel, caramel chocolate. <laughs> I found also these bars of 85% cacao That's, dark chocolate. I like this. That's oh, a good brand. Where are they? That's yes. Oh. We got these as part of a gift from Family Fizz. And oh, these are <laughs> calm down. I want it. There's only four pounds. There's only nine in there. Is that right? That's all right. This is clearly the little snack sweet area, which is meant to get people who of a weak mind i.e. us. We're only like 20 foot in this place. This, this is organic vegan chocolate. Which you'd have to spend like five pound a bar on. They're, yeah, they're really expensive. So that's going in then, yeah? Oh, it's the last one, it's the last one they have. I feel like these are It'd just- It'd be rude not to then. I know. Katie, would you say you can't leave it there for that? I would say that. What have you found? What have you hiding? No way, no booja booja. No way. Oh my, playing chalk as well, Jojo. Jojo, playing oh. chalk. Oh, no. <laughs> Guys, I'm just gonna make you so aware. I need you to look at me. Look, I just need to calm yourself down. Look, they're only three pounds. But listen, I need to make you aware, yeah? The front door is just there. We've only just stepped in. We have a van's worth of stuff in a hire car. We've okay. got space. Look, we have space. There's always space. space for chocolate. Come on, come on. I, I will put the stuff on my lap. <laughs> okay, all right, let's I, go to the I, decision I cannot, then. I cannot leave that there for that. Three pounds, I cannot leave that Well, at the booja booja. I don't know how much the booja booja is, but put that on the trolley, Jojo. Okay, plain chocks going in. Squish it in there, Bogo. Okay, booja booja, we're looking for... Um, oh, no, 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 no. Katie, it's not just that, it's not just that. It's a whole box of them. It's a two for three pounds. Are you absolutely kidding me? Jojo. <laughs> it's not just one of these, it's like it's that. Happened. Twice. Two to three pounds. You, how many did you get in there? Guys, I think we're just going to have to go outside for a breath of fresh air just oh to calm Christ. down. <laughs> my heart's beating really fast right now. <laughs> like, come on. You, like, Whose heart beats fast like, over getting food in supermarkets? I it? might genuinely pass out if this was Lego right This now. is the best chocolate you can buy. And they're normally about, for that size, it's about, it's about a tenner. About a ten, no more. If not, tenner for a gift box like that, I've right? 10, 15 pounds? 15 pounds. And so, what is it, five in one box? Let's see. And then you get two of those boxes for three pounds. You got four in each box. So you can get eight for three pounds. Eight for, oh my goodness. Right, we have to get these. They're still in date as well. Let's put them on. I keep spotting more of this good stuff as well. Where? Seen now. I think there's more around here. You know that same company that's of organic chocolate? Oh yeah. Chocolate mulberries. I love mulberries. I and you love they chocolate. Are. They're called Vanoffi mulberries. What are you doing? I'm, I'm get, I can't leave them there. I'm getting Is that more booja booja? Yeah. Katie. I can give them to people as gifts. Small hire car. It's not a small, it's a decent sized car. You're gonna have it piled on your head. Yeah, we've got loads of stuff in there though. You can't leave it there. You cannot, I can give Katie, you as gifts. Katie, what about all the other stuff you're going to see on this way and feel that way about? <laughs> Look, she, there's nothing stopping her. Mummy, do you realise that if we carry on like this, we will have to get like three trolleys at this way? She's beyond rational thinking now. Look how big this place is. I know, we've not even got round. Like, the entrance is just there and we've come this way. It's a bit like Ikea in the sense that you kind of zigzag around the place, but this is only what we've done so far. There's the entrance and this is what we have left so we're on the other chocolate this one yeah have you I, found it yeah this is it here it's a six pack 
six of those, but I can't figure out the price for one box. Should we just take a chance? Probably like 250 or something. I mean, if Budger Budgers, two for two of those boxes for three pounds. I think we've just got to leg it out now. Just miss out everything else. I want some savoury stuff now. <laughs> Should we just get, get... Let's just get one then. No, let's get two. It might be two for three pounds or something. You can't help yourself, can you? In case it's an offer, I'm going to get two. Dinner sorted for tonight, isn't it? We're having chocolate for dinner. <laughs> Not really, because that would be a very unhealthy thing to do. Eat chocolate in moderation. Oh my goodness, Bob. I think this is another one of that same brand. What are you doing to us? Calm yourself down. <laughs> Please. <laughs> the drinks. And the over there, look all that. Yeah. I mean, for for, for people, diet coke that people, you know, that's a, a normal mainstream drink that you get anyway, and you probably spend three pound a bottle. Yeah. What have you, what have you found? Twenty-five for Bob's flavored quavers. Oh, I think, these I think that's per. That's the retail oh, price per pack. So, Whoa. do you want to see how much they are? Oh, okay. Six pound a case works out forty p each. Oh wow, the quavers. It wasn't it like recently we saw like a pack of crisps like one pound fifty. We were just like, nah, nah, nah. yeah. And normally on their own, one pack is one pound twenty five. But yeah. it's like so that's like seventy percent off. Look, let's think about these. We'll okay. think about these. Five trolleys later. We don't drink these, but five pound a case of Sprite. Yeah. I think you used to drink Sprite, didn't you? Years yeah, ago. I used to drink it all. What you found there? Uh, this is, I'm just looking at this other lemon soda drink. Only five pounds a case, 21p a can. Fairly decent. Yeah, these are a case, is four boxes. This is the thing, I would like to get them. I think, okay, great price, drinks will get used like they've always done. But in my head, I'm having to accommodate your excess of craziness that will happen the rest of this place. I'm having to accommodate all that chocolate for you. Not that I'm going to have any, eh? He's dancing. He's having a great time, isn't he? These look good. I think they're a kombucha of some sort. It says yeah. made from apple cider vinegar. So not kombucha. But these are only two pounds a case. So they work out 17p each. That's really good. Mm. I think get some of these. They'll be good for you driving. Okay. For the sake of two pounds. I can't trust you at the moment. I can't. You can. I'm a good person. <laughs> You're an erratic person. <laughs> why, you are you, San dance. why are you dancing? So you found San Pellegrino, you actually do like those. We got one of these from Rogers before. Oh, the, uh, the one in Southampton. Yeah. yeah. You can tell how popular they are because there's only a few left. Well, what's this? Star Buy. Two bottles for two pounds. Ah, it's margarita. Is this alcohol? I think so, yeah. And a cosmopolitan, I think they're cocktails, right? Ah, I mean, we don't really drink alcohol that much, but for someone that does, that's pretty good. I think it's safe to say that we can call this bit What's It Corner. Oh my goodness. These are the What's It's that we got in the video. Well, we didn't get them in the end, did we? Poundland versus Tesco's? Yeah, we didn't get them in the end. Pretty sure they weren't as good as this price. So 15 packs, £6.50 works out 44p a packet. What are you doing? Nothing. 44p a packet of crisps. Okay, sure. that's really good. Let me have a look. Oh yeah, look, they've done the, they've done the maths for you, Bob. What are you on about? I figured that out all myself. It wasn't like I saw a sign down there and just read it out. <laughs> Should we think about them? Didn't think about the Buja Buja. No, no, no. we just got it. That's a big box though. That is a big box. Oh, so you are thinking about size and space, yeah? <laughs> all of a sudden. Just start dancing. Why? I nearly went to start. <laughs> Found anything good there, Jojo? Indie Bay pretzel bites. Pretzel bites. This is what you get at the airplane, is it? Similar, yeah, you not do. The same brand. Yeah, you get pretzels on the, on planes, don't you? Three pounds a case works at twenty two p each. Oh, mm, I mean that's good. Yeah, I think it's worth it. So I see what happened in here. You're making all the decisions on what goes on the trolley. Yeah. No, it's a small box. So why did we get four buju bujus? Put it on the trolley. Hmm. What have you found there? I feel like we've seen or had these in supermarkets before. Sea salt and balsamic vinegar pea crisp. But yeah, a whole box is four pound a case. Wow, and they work out 50p each. This is a good brand, Organics. It's like a, for babies. And we actually got it from the other Rogers, but we got some other things. Do you remember? 2.50 a case. 2.50 a case. 84p each for a pack of four. So there's four of those in there and there's three packs inside. 
Okay. Then all one of those. Let's get that? Yep. There's too many good savoury snacks. I'm just like, we're just grabbing one of everything, I swear. Not these ones. Exactly. Oh, tomato and herb. Gruffalo claws. She likes the gruffalo. I feel like they might be better than those ones. Should we get those ones instead? Yeah. yeah. I think, I mean, Astrid might like both. But what are they? T they're £2.50 a case as well. So they, they work out less. Two, 21p each. Mm. Okay, get those. I just found some plantain chips. These ones? Yeah. Jojo, look. You like plantain, don't you? It's only £4. Works out 20p each. Do you want some? Because we've got loads of space. I actually recognise these. These are Lidl's. They're Lidl's brand? Yeah. Oh, yeah. How much do those normally cost? 50p? Are you sure it's Lidl's? Lidl's? Yeah. We can't actually find a price on these ones, but they, but they have... They do have this other Snacktastic brand, which is Lidl. That's Lidl's as well. And it works out four bags for two pounds, 50p each. 50p each. I think these ones are probably about 150 in store. Maybe, like something like that. There's those other ones are maybe just 50p anyway. Mm. Katie? Stand back. Oh, it's the tomatoes. Yes. We've got these before. What is it with Napolina doing the cheap price everywhere? Farm foods, heron no, foods? this is really good. These cherry smarts, we got them before at the other Rogers. I think they were two pounds a case, but they're three pounds here. So they work out 50p each. They're tin tomatoes, but they're cherry tomatoes. So they're really nice, really, uh, really sweet. I'm gonna get some. Just making it clear, one for cherry tomatoes, which is like for dinners but four boxes of chocolate. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> so those cherry tomatoes are the first thing that we've got, which is for a meal. Whereas everything else we've got, I swear, is snacks. I know. We've still got all of this zigzag area to go through. There's so much more. And look I at the trolley like size already. I think we're gonna have to get another trolley. We've got so much. How do you feel about sitting on top of the car while we drive home? <laughs> These are two pounds for a case. They're seventeen p each. Gino De Campo is not the of fan of fortunes. Yeah. He was known first for cooking food. True. Organic cannellini beans, two pounds for a case. So you're getting a case of those? Yeah. So how many is twelve in a case? Yeah, we use a lot of beans, so. We use a lot of what, Jojo? Beans. beans. <laughs> Like every time he does that in a supermarket, everyone looks up. Was it any different this time? Everyone is looking at us. <laughs> Look what we found. Vegan mayo bacon -aise. So it's vegan mayo that tastes like bacon. Three pounds for a case, 50p a jar. That's well good. Should They're we like 250. Some? Yeah, we use mayonnaise quite Sam frequently likes, enough. Sam loves it. We'll give him a jar for his birthday. There's so many condiments here. This one, so do you remember, in farm foods it was like 39p, and I think in Heron foods it's like 29p. How much does this work out? 18p. 18, each. now you're excited. No? So you always end I up getting even, excited. Yeah. You do. Let's get one of those for £1.50. We might as well. Yep. What's that? Callow, I know the good friend, I just saw organic. Stock paste. Stock, oh, veggie stock paste. Yeah. Yeah. I we'd use it though. Four pounds a case, 40p each. That's good. Look at this, how cute that is. So like a gift box or something? Yeah, the, it's fruit made of chocolate. Oh, that's cool. That's cute. Oh, Biona, that is a good brand. That's an organic brand. Oh, Pinto beans. Keep your voice down, I don't want Jojo to know there's more beans. Beans! What's that? Rich beetroot risotto. <laughs> oh, more beans. beans. Oh my goodness, one pound 50 a case. That's so good for beans. They're this, organic. This is pretty interesting. Organic buckwheat and sweet potato noodles. Ooh, wanna try it? How much are they? 34 p each. We have to get a whole case though. That's the only yeah. thing. We can't just try one. But let's think about it. Okay. What have you found? Organic green pea fusilli. So obviously it's gluten-free pasta, but it's organic. Good old Napolina again. Oh, we have to get that. That's really good. Well, we have passed. I mean, the time, so. I say it's good. I don't know how much it is. I'm just like it's got to be four fifty, which works and out thirty eight p for, a, for each one. Each one, yeah, get that. Those would be good in the van. They'll be really. They'll helpful. be good. Get a box. I got nacho kits. You buy two for three fifty. One seventy five each. Not the biggest saving, but you can get store brand ones about the same price mm. in uh, like Lidl's and places yeah. like that. Me and Jojo just found something really cool down here. Come and have a look. You know when you go in hotels and oh, you get the little Marmite pots? I love these. They would be good for the van, wouldn't they? Well, you just take a handful at a time instead of a jar. Three pound a box and it works out that they're 3p each. I don't know how to compare that though. Yeah. Because you never bought. 
baby food. Pound for this one, two pounds for this one. I oh. feel like we got that stuff before for Astrid or Jamie I think has. We did, yeah. I'm not sure she, Astrid has these though anymore. No, I'm not sure. What have you found here? Uh, my eyes were caught by a snack bar, which I think is organic. Ooh. So organic raw fruit bar, goji berries, dates, coconut. That's good, and it's cow powder. And they're four pound a case. Yeah. Nice. I get that, I think, yeah. They'll fit in the car, definitely. I think so. <laughs> we might have to get rid of chocolate to accommodate them. This is brilliant. This is brilliant. <laughs> She's gone serious free gang. I'd buy this coconut meal, because it's really good for curries and things like that. And it's a pack of, I think, six in there. So a pack four, of six. Four pounds, 67p each. I pay about one pound 89 for this. So that's like a third of the price really really good oh more than one this is almost as important as chocolate i want to get at least three of them really say bye bye to some chocolate then say bye to the crisps what we've, got so much stuff. we've still got all of this left guys going round there and over to the back and a trolley which is almost completely full this is amazing value for a case of these sunflower seeds you get little packs in there it's one pound for a whole case, which makes the packs only 15p each. Oh, is that gluten-free? Gluten-free bread, yes. Oh, nice. How much is it? Because that's expensive normally. Yeah, three pound a case. So it works out one pound each for a loaf. Basically, one of these for a pound. Wow. Uh, you just buy one case. That's actually quite good. There's a lot of you guys who are gluten-free and you're saying about how expensive it is, so Rogers is a good thing to consider if you have one anywhere near you. We don't eat these. They work out only 25p for a pack. And they got loads of them. Do you remember these things? This is what we got before. The this snacks. Was. Mini flapjack bikes by Organics. These are different ones. They've got OT bars as well. So they're good snacks as well for Astrid if we wanted to get one. Oh, chickpeas. Crunchy chickpeas. But they're nice. What have you found? Gold coins. Well, I found two things. We got these last time, didn't we? Yeah, no, they're like extremely spicy, but I really love them. They're really nice. They're not extremely spicy. I, do you know what? I think we thought they were going to be something else, didn't we? Yeah, they and are... What's the deal? Four packs, is it? Four, four... Two, two pounds. 50p each. That's all right, isn't it? Found more sweet stuff. Yeah, they're Skittles. Squishy ones. We've had these before. And they're five pound a case for 14 of them, which works works out 36p 36. 36 each. And they're normally a pound. That's really good. We found these cliff bars. They're mini ones, not the big chunky one. Chunky and ones. they are four pound a box, 40p each. Oh, they've got peanut butter ones too. Ooh, they're the same price. Mm. What have you found? I think vegan marshmallows. No way. Look who's excited now. Mmm, yeah. some kind of cereal. It's a panda in space. Two pounds a case, 17p each. Sounds good. Oreos. Right, we are actually coming to the end now, so we're just oh, gonna. Yeah, there. yeah, let's have a check what they have along here. Some last minute buys. Do we need any more chocolate? <laughs> How we I feel like we do. What's that? Ketchup. Ketchup? How much is it? Mines. It is three bottles for £3.50, works at £1.17 each. So not bad. Not bad, not bad. Whole pack of gummies. That, that's like a nice gift, isn't it? Hmm. This is what we're talking about when we're mentioning seasonal products. Stuff for Christmas, but... But yeah. they were from last Christmas. I think before we got some Easter stuff, didn't we? Yeah. And it was an Easter. But it was still in date. Yeah, and it got eaten. It did. So these that work out only 50p each for like chocolate snowmen. So I'm just wanted to say, lucky we did not have the van here. My goodness, because yeah. Because we probably would have got like two, maybe three trolleys full of... There'd be no restriction, would there? This place is huge. They have so, so much, much good stuff. So much good stuff. So we had to be very picky in what we did get. We still got lots, and we still got to figure out how to get it in the hire car. Right, so we're going to go home now, and we're going to figure out how much we have saved all together, and let you know how much it costs and how much we save. So we're back home now, guys. Back in London. Look at all this stuff. I'm practically hiding behind this. I'm just laughing because we just look like two heads. That was actually a lot of fun. I'm so glad we went there. It's huge as well, so much stuff. We won't go through everything individually, but we'll tell you how much we spent and how much we saved. But yeah. I will tell you a couple of the things that I'm so excited about. She's got some favorites list. 
I have a favourites list. My first favourite is these Budja Budja Gourmet Chocolates. If you know about Budja Budja, you know. Say no more. Top chocolates. Yeah. Amazing price. The guy on the checkout said it's actually three pounds for two of these boxes. We thought it was for two of the big boxes. Yeah, but that still works out. These are £1.50 each. Normally, they are on average £20 everywhere else when we checked online. Yeah, that's over 90% saved. About 95% saved. And we figured out, we've eaten some already, that the only thing wrong with these is when you open the box. All right, there it goes. The piece of paper, what flavour chocolate is which, as you get in most boxes of chocolate, all it is is upside down. Yeah, but they've also got the names of the flavours underneath the chocolates too. Yeah, so the flavours underneath were actually wrong as well. So all you had to do was flip this the other way round and then you know which ones you're getting. Just a printing problem, right? This is what I'm talking about. It's not always sell by date. Sometimes it's because there's something wrong with the packaging yeah. or something like that. But I'm going to give some of these to Darren and Georgie. I'm going to give some to my, my lovely Greek friend. And don't tell them. <laughs> So when people go, ooh, salted caramel, and then they get ginger. No, we have to tell them. Just all turn, right. all you have to do is turn the thing around. It's not a big deal. Yeah, I'm so excited about those. I was excited about these raw chocolate companies. There's a lot of chocolate excitement in this video. These are normally three pounds a pack, and we paid four pounds for a whole case of them. Six of them. Yes, yeah, six of them. Also, the raw chocolate company, they're also normally three pounds each. For an individual one. And we paid four pounds for a whole case, again. Pack of 10. Oh, and these, the coconut milks. I use these organic coconut milks all the time. But they're like 2 50 a tin or something They're like normally that? about two pounds. Sometimes I can get them for one pound 50, but on average they're about two pounds. We paid four pounds for a whole case of them, which made them 67p each, which, oh my goodness, that's amazing. Yeah, I'm really excited about this organic pasta as well. Gluten-free organic pasta. It ended up being 40p each for these, so that's incredible. Well, I'm excited about everything here, really. I really, I'd love to go there again as well. Okay, we have the receipt here. You're not going to believe this, but the total amount we spent was only £73.50. Yeah, we did some calculations on what the recommended retail price of all of these products are, whether they're individual or as a pack, and it turned out that the total cost of all of this food is £509.10. Yeah. Which means we saved around 85%. Yeah, I can't believe if you had, we had a bought all of this stuff at regular supermarkets, we would have spent over 500 pounds. So Rogers is definitely worth it. I did get four cases of the Budja Budja. If we hadn't got that, it would have only come to about 50 pounds. Yeah, she got very excited. He kept saying to me all the way around, he was like, are you sure you don't want to put up one of those back? He suggested that I put two boxes back at one point, and I said no. You should have seen the face that she gave me when I suggested it. We have friends who would very much appreciate these chocolates. And it's coming up to Christmas. I can get some serious friendship points. I bet they won't even make it to the friends. They won't get past your belly. No, I will. I'm not greedy. I'm, I'm, a, I'm a nice, generous person. But as you can see, guys, we did amazing here. We've loved sharing this haul with you guys. We'd love to hear your comments below. If you've been to Rogers before, or if you've got one near you, where you could find one, maybe, we definitely recommend it. It's well worth it. We have tested a few of the products on the way home, and I can tell you that everything so far that we've had has been good quality, and it's tasted fine, yeah, hasn't it? Yeah, you wouldn't so. have any difference. But that's where we're going to end today's video, guys. We appreciate you so much, and thank you for watching, and we'll see you all in the next video. Just remember, though, guys, no matter where you are in the world, you guys always stay free. And just keep rising.